Hi everybody, welcome to the trending stream here on the World Wide Web. Please, please uh, subscribe, click and hit that bell to get all the latest video notifications. In other words, whenever I make a brand new video, you should be notified. I really would appreciate it and I want to thank all the brand new subscribers. We got lots of top trending news. That's what I do here. Let's get to it. One story that I have not covered is Kyle Rittenhouse. Uh, you guys remember last year, he was the guy who went to the BL, you know, M protest and uh, basically took out two men and, sh you know, took out another one almost. But anyway, it was in uh, Wisconsin, right? This guy here, and I call him um, Kyle Rottenhouse. Now, he was on trial. He's still on trial right now. We're still waiting uh, for the verdict. But, you know, LeBron James says something. Now, I know a lot of people are on the fence with this trial. I'll give you my take on it. But let's listen. Check, check this out. Let's listen to what LeBron James says. He, he said, what tears? Knock it off. LeBron James mocks Kyle Rittenhouse. I call him Rittenhouse because I think the guy is straight up rotten. I don't like the kid. Okay? Now, you know. I'll give you more of my take here in a second. But anyway, Rotten House breaks down in court and claims that, uh, you know, he started crying, all these things. And uh, LeBron James said that he ate some lemon heads before giving evidence, right? So LeBron James pokes fun at Kyle Rotten House breakdown on Wednesday. The team began, began sobbing, crying, while recounting the moments he took out two men and hurt another in a BLM, you know, protest. James said he did not see a tear and that Rotten House must have eaten or eaten some lemon heads before walking into court. Now we're going to, I'm going to play the video here. Okay, guys, we're going to play the video. We're going to see if this dude shed a tear. Well, there's, there's a little tear there, right? Kyle broke down witnesses and all these things. And, and LeBron James said, come on, man, stop it already. Stop with the false shedding of tears and all this stuff. And people were upset. Uh, some people came to LeBron James, right? James had previously been critical about, you know, the police and things, um, which sparked the protest. This guy named Jake Jacob Blake, uh, which sparked the protest where Rotten House went across lines, uh, was only 17, had a gun, right? So he was already in the wrong. He shouldn't have been there, really. And then many people, again, are joining James and mocking the team. I'm not mocking. I'm just pointing things out. And then uh, many came to defend and refute the NBA stars. So many people are on Rotten House, right? So here's the video here. Let's listen in a little bit here, guys. Let's get to it. And then we'll talk about Britney. We'll talk about a lot of other stuff here. This is a jam-packed episode. Thanks again for coming aboard. Let's see the tears, if Go there's any. Next. As I'm stepping forward, I believe his name is now Joshua Zeminski. He steps towards me with a pistol in his hand, and as um as I'm walking, it's and, almost and, like a duper's delight, guys. If you don't know what a duper's delight is, there's like a smile. I, I covered um, Alec Baldwin when he was interviewed for the first time. And Alec Baldwin was like, look, a life is gone. And then he smiled. Like, you know, and that's why I called the video the Alec Baldwin's deadly smile. So let's look, look again at this kid here. All right, let's go back. Okay. As again, he's describing when he was attacked and he's saying, well, I had to do these things. Walking, as, I, as I'm walking towards to put out the fire, I drop the fire extinguisher and I, I take a step back. Okay. When you step back from Mr. Zeminski, what's your plan? My plan is to get out of that situation and go back north down Sheridan Road to where um, the car source lot number two was. And did you get... Look at his eyes, guys. Complete. Yeah. All right, okay. All right, let's continue. Were you able to go in a northerly direction? I, I wasn't. Describe what happened. I, once I take that step back, I look over my shoulder and Mr. Rosenbaum. Look at his hand. Look at his hand right here. Oh, ooh, guys. You see, this is why, guys, and I have my opinion. 
this kid is no bueno. Okay, number when he was young, he shouldn't have been there. Okay, let the adults do whatever. I'm not going to get too much into the case, but people were saying, you know, protect your property, stay out of everything else because he was protecting uh, auto place or whatever. Here, look at the hands, right? You see the hands, okay? Right here. Uh, let's see if I could, where is it here? I thought I seen the other ones. I'm going to be doing hand symbols or whatever here, whatever, but he's doing this hand sign, okay? Notice the fingers, right? This is from the dark energies, guys. You know what these, these people are. Again, the finger to the middle and things. So again, he's he's doing his outcry now. Many And the judge himself is a part of the agenda as well, guys. I, I have to be careful what I say, right? Y'all know. But anyway, let's go back. Look at the hand gesture. To a finger to the two. And it doesn't have to be completely out. So, so there you go. This is one of the main reasons. Okay, and this is what these guys that are into these clubs, because it's a club, it's a dark club, and they know what to do to, to try to reach out. They're calling in the dark energies and calling out people that are associated with this dark club. I have to be careful what I say. There you go. Number one reason right there. Let's continue on. I was now running from my right side. Um, and I was cornered from in front of me with Mr. Zeminski and there were real quick too he's also using subliminal in his clothing he's wearing blue now when you associate blue or whatever and this kid was claiming to be almost like a, a, a cop helper this is like a police uniform so he's playing the game. Like he's there. He was there to help, whatever. Now again, did they did these fools rush him and he did what he did? Yes, they were idiots too. All of them are a bunch of idiots, to be honest. Anybody with a coherent brain would never put themselves in those types of, uh, you know, whatever, their agenda, whatever. But anyway, so the blue that he's wearing, the blue. And what do we say? The cops, the blues, the men in blue. So he's doing that as well. He's a shifty he's a shifty dude and also you know he's got his crooked lawyers they're telling him what to do or his lawyers right let's continue on listen where are the tears where are the tears uh, LeBron James is right for what guys you know I don't like LeBron James that much either but right here where is it yeah he squeezed one out anybody would squeeze one out when they gotta go visit Big Bubba when Big Bubba is coming for you when you're in jail and you're only 18, they want you. I Anybody could, <laughs> but, but look, he stops in here. Let's let's see if the more tears come out. There ain't no now. This is what they call crocodile tears. When no tears, little five-year-olds, six-year-olds, when they don't get their way in the store, <laughs> they're not really crying though, right? This is this is what I call the hackers. The actor at actor. Okay, we already seen them do the sign. This is what these these dirty, you know, the dirty clubs do, right? Showing their alliances. He's one of them. And then uh, now, where's the, where's the tears? Let's continue on. <laughs> He's, dude, it's like squeezing a fart. It, I, I don't mean to be funny, but it's like you know, it's like like you know, somebody's hanging out with their friends. And he's like, man, I want to, I want to give him one, and they want to, they want to blow that turd, and they're pushing. It's like he's pushing for that tear. There was... <laughs> where, where, where is it? Where, dude? This should be coming down. This should be waterfall falls. There should be his, you know, the way he's pushing, the way he's shaking, <laughs> like, like LeBron James said. Like LeBron James said, this guy looked like he had a couple lemon heads. And, and really thinking, man, I got to do the show. You know, and, and, and guys, for one minute, don't think. One minute, don't think that this man is on the stand for a reason. You don't think that his lawyers told him, okay, we're going to put you up front. And you you better you better do the, the works, the, the, the cry works, whatever. They got to see you as a human and that they cornered you and all these things. Now, again, I'm not defending nobody in this case, right? Trust me. These two men now are dead. 
the skateboard guy and the other guy that chased him in the parking lot and he took both these guys out. They're both ignorant. They're all ignoramuses. Here's the lawyer. Here's his lawyer. Okay, look at him. He's wearing the red and blue, red and blue lodges, right? You don't think that he sold him to go and stand and, and, and make it happen and there you got the, the crooked judge. Remember, the courts is the court. A court like a baseball court, a basketball court, all these things. Notice here, the symbols the twin pillars, all this stuff, guys, right? He's been on this kid through whatever. Very tragic, right? But again, we're dealing with a bunch of ignoramuses here, okay, or whatever. So let's continue on. Remember, let's see more tears because he hasn't shed one, but he is, man, really pushing those like that dirty little stinky farb that hasn't came out yet. Where is it? Like, he's squeezing, boy. He's looking like the lemon head. LeBron. LeBron James, baby. I got it. I, 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 you're a punk, too, but, man, you got it. And then I got this picture. The, uh, look at here, guys. Okay, so you see him. Here, here he is. Blue eyes, brown hair, right? Okay, 17 years old. Should have never been there. Let's be honest. Okay, he went out of state. Shouldn't have had the gun. It wasn't his gun. He's crying like a storm, right? We're seeing the video here. LeBron James, man, he looked like a lemon head. Straight up lemon head. Look at the same, same color of hair, the big blue eyes, right? Look at that. <laughs> right? But, but, but he, he's going to squeeze that one out. He's going to squeeze that little tear out. He better because he knows Big Bubba's waiting for him. Big Brother Bubba, he's coming for him. Okay, LeBron, I'm with you, bro. Let's continue on. And, and you know, you may be upset with what I'm saying. But again, I have studied human behavior, guys. This is what I do. I've been doing this for a very, very long time. I've done the studies. I've always, uh, you know, I, at one point in my life, I want to become a psychologist. And I've studied those tactics and how the CIA reads people. Okay? This is an act. This is a hack. Okay? Perpetrated or pushed and, and coached. By who? Well, the lawyer. That's why you you you, uh, you never see a plaintiff go on the the you know the 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 stand. But they said, okay, go on there, say it, and, and boy, you better put the works. And boy, did he ever! But unfortunately, uh, we don't see too much from Mr. Lemonhead Rotten House. Let's continue on. <laughs> Where? Where? Oh! Oh! He squealed! He breathed! Oh! 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 Oh, he, I think he's getting one, guys. Oh, my gosh! Where's the tears? That's right, run. Oh, he... Oh! I could do that, too. Oh, look! He looked at the... He looked at the judge for acknowledgement. This is an act, brothers and sisters. Y'all better wake up. Y'all better wake up. This kid is a hack. But whatever. Hey, you know, here again, Mr. Lemon at Rotten House. And now this guy here, right? We're going to go back to the videos footage, guys. Don't worry. I'm here for you. I'm giving it to you raw. Raw and DD. Again, prosecutors make extraordinary admission. Okay, so now... You have the uh, prosecutors, the people that are going against him, the lawyer, these guys, the prosecutors now go, well, we kind of messed up. Uh, the prosecutor admission that reasonable jury could have quit Kyle Rittenhouse. So they, they go, wow, you know, we really don't have that much of a case, whatever. Um, so we're going to go and, and try to press for a multitude of lesser charges to try to get, uh, you know, Rittenhouse shooters to more jail time. So, you know, and the judge has been against these guys, yelling at them, and all of these things. The judge uh, will instruct the jury how to apply each charge. So now they're going, well, we may not get that. Here's this guy, uh, uh, Gross Gretzky or whatever, who shot, uh, you know, he shot him in the arm or whatever, blown out his thing. Uh, look at this guy. Arrogant, actor, actor, Right? And now these guys are going, we got we to gotta get him in something. He's got six charges on him. So they're going to try. And one of the pictures that they, that they got in trouble for showing, and I'm showing it right now to you, is this photo here. 
So he took out two people, took out that guy's arm, and then here he is with the, you know, the proud guys, you know, I got to be careful what I say. And then here it goes, here it goes, he says this, uh, you know, here he's smiling, it's hard to take the tears off of Kyle Rotten, how seriously, seeing how just a few months ago, right, partying in a bar, the kid's not 18 years old, doing this, this symbol here, which is the proud, you know, you guys know. I got to be careful when I say these boys, right? This symbol here, this is number two, why I don't like this guy. Number three, I don't like him because he's a hack because of this symbol here. This symbol here in the, 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 those clubs that I was telling you about right here is the 666. Right there, you see the hand gesture that he was doing, okay? All there. That's what this comes from, okay? All there. So in a matter of seconds, watching this video, and I'm just going to... I'm going to make this video to have this video right here. Again, you be the judge, whatever. I'm going to rewind. He's acting. You're, it's like when you're acting and there's a director there. And you look at the director to go, am I doing a good job? Right? Here. Let's go again. Look look how he's pushing. No tears, Harley. I think we see one tear. Okay, we'll give him that in the high definition photo or whatever. There was one that he finally squeezed out. Where's this side? Only one? Oh, come on. You can do better than that. This is your life on the line, right? But anyway, this guy's doing all the, the system hand gestures. The actors, I could tell a hack, an actor a mile away. I could smell a rat. rat. Let's continue on. <laughs> Squeezing. Like, he's on the toilet. Look, look, look. And then... <laughs> oop, oop. <laughs> oh, oh, look. Am I doing a good job? Am I gonna get on of them? Am I gonna get on? Um, uh, am I doing? Uh, 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 uh. Yeah, guys, this is sad, and yet people would defend this guy. Now again, the deep men were fools. The men were fools that chased a man with a loaded. I mean, okay, you, you can't, you know, you can't. It, it is what it is. But this guy, nah, nah, he's no bueno. No bueno means he's no good. He's rotten house. Let's continue on. Can we get a break? Minute, look, look. Oh, now I think he squeezed that one. Oh, of course, of course. The it's called theatrics, guys. It's called theatrics. He knows it. We all know it. Like, oh my, yeah. So there you go. You let me know, Doc. I was going to do more videos. I'm going to make another video here. I had a lot of stories, but I'm going to keep it at this one. I like just covering main stories. Again, other people. Here's LeBron James. What tears? I didn't see one. Man, knock it off. That boy ate some lemon heads before walking into court. Mr. Lemonhead. Looking just like him, too. Looking just like Mr. Lemonhead. Looking like Mr. Lemonhead. You know, the candy. Looking like a garbage pal kid. Put the tear right there. Look, look, look. Come on, man. Come on, bro. You know, LeBron James is a fake, too. He's a, he's a hell of an athlete, but he's a fake as well. We know. It. Here's, you know, this is also LeBron James over here. Listen, I don't like none of them. Okay, I'm an equal opportunist calling for what it is. LeBron James has cried the crocodile tears, too. LeBron James has flubbed, fell, and all these things. Okay, come on now. Come on. They're all, they're all hackers, as I like to call them. So there you guys go. Let me know down below <laughs> what y'all think about this. I haven't talked about it. I feel sad for these guys. But you know what they are, a bunch of I, whatever. Yeah, mom too. Notice, could you imagine your mom being there, your family being there, you're on the stand, you have already been told the lawyers, and you see your mom cry. So of course... You know, you can move up those agendas. You think about Big Brother Bubba there, you know? You know? Come on. So there it is. The subliminals, the hand gestures, the no tears, all that stuff. I got to be careful with that. And it is all there. So anyway, guys, there you go. You know, you can't make this stuff up. Mr. Lemonhead, look at there. Look at him just like him there. Right? You going, you know, whatever. There you go, guys. Thanks again for coming aboard. 
another jaw-dropping video. I hope you let me know what you think. Am I wrong? Hey, I'm just reporting. I'm giving you my commentary. I just think I, I only see one tear. Out of all that, like I said, it was like pushing a fart. <laughs> you know? I seen people, I seen little kids act like that. Heck, I even seen grown people. I seen LeBron James. It's a, it's an act. It's a hack. There you go. But you let me know down below. I love you guys. Thank you so much. The channel is growing. Share these videos. Thanks. And let's keep the conversation going down below. Take care. Much love. Have a blessed one.